Actually, no insurance runs for the Tigers because they did not have the lead going into last inning. They got the lead. Is tied. Here's the one up. Fastball low, two and up. Swung on, line softly towards right. Nice catch, Hill. My ball in is there. <laughs> Basket catch. Nice play. Romero, uh, this is likely his last inning. It's been very good, but just a few mistakes, and the Tigers have been able to capitalize on those mistakes, and they have the lead. That is why they have the lead. But Romero's been very good. He started out this game four and a third perfect. So he's had a very good start, very good debut. Got him. That'll end it for him. Looking. Leadoff double, or excuse me, first leadoff double for the Blue Jays today, and another leadoff hit for them. So they need to score here to tie this game up. Up the middle, here comes Lind, and that is going to tie the game. Rod Barajas, base hit, and this game is tied here in the bottom of the seventh. So at the very least, Ricky Romero will not get the loss, but a no decision.
All right, so just as the Blue Jays uh, gave up the lead back in the fifth, uh, here the Tigers give up the lead and the game is tied, and that's the ninth hit for the Blue Jays, yet only two runs. So this is probably Jackson's last batter. And that'll end the inning. Double play. Blue Jays unable to take the lead, but they do tie it up in the seventh. Thanks to a Rod Barajas base hit up the middle. That scored Adam Lind. So 2-2. Two, two. Headed to the eighth. That'll be, do it. For Ricky Romero. Great. Great start. Five hits, seven innings, and uh, I believe six strikeouts. And two earned runs, so really nice job by Ricky Romero. Also no walks. So it'll be up to Sean Camp and the rest of the Blue Jays bullpen to try and hold this, and then hopefully the Blue Jays can take the lead and try to get a win here. So Sean Camp and the Blue Jays bullpen will take it from here. Got him. Camp comes in and strikes out the first batter he sees on three pitches. Nice catch by Lind. And it's Placido Polanco now. Tripled is his last appearance. Ace is empty with two outs. First count on Polanco. Here's the on the ground, Scooter Road. Camp comes in and it's a Gets a 1-2-3 inning. Gets a 1-2-3. Nice job. Bottom of the eighth coming up. Gonna be a leadoff double for the Blue Jays here in the bottom of the eighth. Nice job. A little blooper and nobody was going out to catch it at all. So that sets up the Blue Jays very nicely. So that's gonna get the Blue Jays warming up. Uh, their closer, BJ Ryan. And that's going to get them the lead. And Roland is headed for two, and he's going to get in there, and it's 3-2 Blue Jays here in the bottom of the eighth. Jackson is still out there after giving up 11 hits. Just get it in 
insurance one or two to protect early. Liner towards the hole, and the play made by Polanco. That will hold the runner in second. Got a lot rushing and battle in this pack right here. You can see he's determined to go up there and battle. Let's see who wins this battle. And the first pitch. That's one is high. One and oh. You have to cut the pitcher. He's not afraid to challenge guys that force him to bat the ball up in the zone. Spins with a throw behind the runner. And he dives back safely. All right, that's going to be an error on Everett, I believe, and Lynn is going to reach his first and third with two down. And Edwin Jackson is still out there. All right, it's going to be Clay Rapata coming in to face Travis Snyder, who doubled in his last at bat. Snyder trying to add another run to the Blue Jays' lead. Deep center field. Granderson back on it. He will make the catch, but the Blue Jays take the lead here in the eighth. And the top of the ninth is coming up. Scott rolling with the, uh, with the RBI to take the lead. RBI double. And Ryan will be the closer. BJ Ryan coming in to get uh, looking for his first save. And this is also his first opportunity, first save opportunity. Got him. One down, one, two, three. B.J. Ryan strikes out. Miguel Cabrera gets him with the slider swinging. ball wind is there. Ryan just kind of got lucky there. So, uh, all right, so two down, and Blue Jays looking for their first win and looking to even out this series one to one. Like one at 92 with the fast ball by Ryan. Good life on this fastball. He just buries it down the way. A swing line to left center. And that's going to be a base hit. Tying run is on. It 
it's Gary Sheffield. Two outs and a man on first. And he starts Sheffield out. Back one to Sheffield. As a hitter, you don't want to fall too far behind in the count. Right now, you want to be able to know what pitch he's going to throw. Strike two to Sheffield. DJ Ryan trying to stay away from him. So I'm throwing him something out of the strike zone to see if I can get up the chase. Over Bay, keep him close. Two pitch from Ryan on up the middle. But that is not an out, so there are two down and two on. Two on, two out for BJ 